The FAA is investigating a scare at JFK Airport. Two planes nearly collided. That's really scary, coming within a thousand feet of each other. Dre Clark is live at JFK right now with what in the world happened and how air traffic control reacted. I'm just trying to imagine how often this happens. Uh, rare, thankfully, uh, but certainly very scary for those individuals who are on board that flight on Friday night. Meanwhile, the FAA certainly has been busy as of lately. As you guys know, last week on Wednesday, the federal agency uh, said that an outage to a safety alert system that pilots use caused thousands of flights across the country to be either delayed or canceled. And now you have this incident that happened here at JFK on Friday night. And it was a very close call here. And in fact, you'll hear a recording of the air traffic controllers and you can hear the panic in their voices once they realize they have two airplanes that are actually on a collision course. Luckily, the accident was prevented, but now the FAA is trying to get a really full understanding of what exactly happened here. Now, the incident happened on Friday night, just after 8.30, on runway 4 left here at JFK. This is actual radar showing those planes on Friday night. According to the FAA, Delta Airlines Flight 1943, which was a Boeing 737, which you can see here in red, was preparing for takeoff when it came to a sudden stop within 1,000 feet of slamming into an American Airlines plane that was taxiing across the runway in front of the Delta flight. Listen to the air traffic controllers as they notice the problem and quickly get a handle on the situation. American 1036 heavy, American 1036 heavy, hold position. American 1036 heavy, hold position. Delta 1943, cancel takeoff plans. Delta 1943, cancel takeoff plans. Rejecting. Tower American 1036 heavy. American 1036 heavy. The last class we were given, we were cleared to uh, cross. Is that correct? American 106 Heavy, uh, we're departing runway 4 left. Um, I guess we'll listen to the tapes, but uh, you were supposed to depart runway 4 left. You're currently holding short of uh, 3 1 left. Roger, American 106 Heavy. And you can hear the air traffic controller telling the pilot, don't worry, we will definitely go back and check the tape. Meanwhile, this was a statement that Delta Airlines released, saying in part, Delta will work with and assist aviation authorities on a full review of Flight 1943 on January 13th regarding a successful aborted takeoff procedure at New York JFK. We apologize to our customers for the inconvenience and delay of their travels. Meanwhile, American Airlines did not offer any comment on what exactly happened here. Now, 143 people and six crew members were on board that plane after the incident happened. The plane did go back to the gate, and we were told all of those passengers stay in a hotel overnight because of a crew issue, and they resumed their flight to the Dominican Republic the following morning. Mitch. All right, it's good to know that they made it off the plane safely and eventually made it to their destination. No one was harmed here. But joining us now, uh, thank you, Dre. Joining thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.